today is Tuesday. Today's so Tuesday. We have our story time on Tuesday. So on Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni, in Building 411, on the third floor, you'll find a place unknown by many and underused by most. This magnificent place strives to encourage kids to love books and to form lifelong reading skills at an early age. Um, we want to reinforce pre-reading skills, so there are a couple of things um, like print motivation, so um, learning how books work, learning about um, authors and illustrators, uh, having exposure to different stories, um, and also, you know, they learn new vocabulary that they might not get in other places, um, recognizing letters, things like this that are going to help them when they, re when they start to read. You know, we want kids to love books and to encourage them to read, so that's one of our main motivations. For residents like Erica Tubbs, a mother who homeschools her five-year-old daughter, staying engaged and on the same track as her peers is especially important. Anya really enjoys getting to hear the different stories and uh, we homeschool so it's a nice opportunity for her to sit with the other kids and get that environment, that circle time environment that she might not learn otherwise. She reads already. Uh, she can read some easy, you know, three letter short vowel words. So yeah, she definitely enjoys getting the exposure to the different stories and different themes. The way different people present the books and stories and the words. And I think the some of the sing-along songs and stuff are good too. It helps them learn to follow directions and interact with other children in a group environment. Early literacy time at the library is a great opportunity for all children to take part in story time. But more importantly, it gives kids a chance to spend time with each other in a day and age where social media is the main source of communication. Reporting from Marine Corps Air Station Iwakuni, Japan, I'm Lance Corporal Cheyenne Newman.